So your hard work and practice has finally paid off. You're starting to sound good on your instrument, and now you want to take it a step further. You want to start diving into the world of improvisation. You want to start creating your own solos and your own melodies over all of your favorite songs, playing with your favorite musician friends. I can boil it down into two basic things that you need to know. The first thing you need to know is the key signature of the song that you're about to improvise over. So for this, I'm going to pretend like I'm improvising over a song that's written in the key of G minor. The second thing that you want to know is a scale that works over that key signature. Now that's something you can either learn through music theory or you can even Google it. What scale works on G minor? Probably the first thing that comes up is going to be the G minor pentatonic scale. You need to learn the scale that goes over that. Really easy. So once you've got comfortable with that, then there's only a few basic things that you need to understand. The first thing you need to understand is that most of the notes in your solo are going to come right from that scale. It doesn't have to be in that order, but they've got to come from that scale to make it sound commercially acceptable. The second thing that you have to consider is in order to make your solo sound like it's meant to be in the song, you've got to end on one of the notes in that scale. That's going to be the most commercially acceptable thing to do. So if you end your solo or phrase or melody on a note that's in this scale, it's going to sound that much better. So the majority of the notes come from the scale, and the last note definitely comes from the scale. All the other notes can be whatever you want. A good thing to maybe try is to slide up or down chromatically from a note that's a half step below or above the note that you want to do. Then, just play. You can't go wrong. information to add to this video, be sure to post it in the comments below. I want to read it, and I know everybody else does too. Thanks for watching, guys.